Shalom, Shalom. All praises, honor, and glory. It goes to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim, Rukah Kodash. Double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders of Great Millstone. Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Brack a thumb to the hopeful elect. Shalom, Shalom. Today's video is going to be entitled, We Need the Passover Because We Need the Protection. And uh, for those who don't know, Passover is three weeks away on March 5th, I believe. You know, that's that's the time where the Israelites were commanded, you know, to, to kill an unblemished lamb and to eat bitter herb and unleavened bread. Because in that same very night, the Most High was going to smite the uh, firstborn of all the Egyptians and let his let his people free. You see, and this this tradition that's been carried on for years and years, even until this day. And you know, the Wadi Yahweh Bashim Shah for putting us in remembrance of our high holy days, so that we may partake and have the same remembrance as the Scripture commands us to do, especially here in these days, man. Because all hell might break loose after the Passover. And we, we say that every year, but we looking at it, we looking at news clippings. And this, this, ain't, this ain't a normal year whatsoever. You know, more chariot sightings are, are being seen, you know, and more documented and, and released uh, reports regarding the chariots are being uh, released. You know, brothers have been seeing seeing the signs in the heavens themselves. 30,000 30, plus people died over an earthquake in, in like the, the first or second month of the year. You know, you got the you got the train derailments, you got the damn gases. Man, women getting snatched up every day, niggas getting killed every day, man. We 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 really don't know how precious the blood of Yahusha has been to us because you know to a certain extent we we've been able to be protected we've been able to to be looked out after you know you don't know how many times you you uh you were that close to death throughout the year you know but yahweh bashmiao shot <coughs> lucky yahweh bashmiao shot made a way for you to not only to, to stay alive but to continue in his truth and doing the things that he commanded of us, man. Like I said, you don't you don't know how precious the blood of Yahweh Shai is until we get on those chariots, man. Especially with you know the times to come of Jacob's trouble. You know you're gonna you're gonna need you're gonna need these things. You're gonna need to do rituals like this. You know, and that's what Passover basically is. It's, it's a ritual for protection, and it's also you renewing your vows. To how about Shemiah Shah, man? You're gonna be want to be joined unto the Lord when 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 it's all hell breaking loose, bodies dropping on the floor, man. You know when it's slow singing and flower bringing. You understand? Cause you know brothers have dreams where all hell breaks loose and you know somehow some way we were able to be protected. We we're able to escape the judgment. You know brothers had dreams where they get where they get locked up in a in a in a in a FEMA camp, but somehow. They're able to make it through. That's the blood of Yahweh over you. You see, what's this, what is it saying that Revelation? Uh, I think it's Revelation 12 and 11. It say, Rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in the earth. Well, no, no, that's that's 12 and 12. But it said they, they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and the word of their testimony. That's how the elect are gonna make it by the blood of Yahweh. You know, like I said, you don't know how many damn near fatal car crashes you could have been in. You don't know how many uh, how many times you've been around some some wicked ass nigga plotting to rob somebody, but somehow he decided not not, not to touch you. You know, you don't know how how many times you <laughs> you could have you could have been this close to, to dealing with a with a wicked ass woman, but you know the spirit was able to 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 give you a, a detour where you don't get caught up in those things, man. You see, that's 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 just how important this time is, and we know it's important because the uh, the demons get heavier and heavier and more intense and more intense during this time of the year, man. It seems like certain 
certain challenges or you know certain obstacles that that you didn't you didn't overcame this year kind of come back and you like damn like i, I thought <laughs> i thought i got over this shit already but no man that's it, it's just the time of the passover the, the the spiritual entities are high man on the left hand and on the right hand you know the angels they they hard at work right now but so are the demons you know that's why you know af after the little uh you know af after this little cheap shit you know went down man we hey, it's, it's best to just keep keep your head down now i'm speaking to myself you know but i know other brothers as well man right now these, these next three weeks this ain't this ain't the time to, to be to be doing a lot it's really a time of reflection and repentance and and and, and a spirit of gratefulness like i said you don't you don't know how close you don't know how close you you were to death these past this past year and and the times to come man especially now you know because what if, what if a damn earthquake hit here in kansas city and, and we don't we don't have a bloody howashai on us we gonna we're gonna be out there looking like human pancakes man under a fucking concrete concrete building but through the spirit and power of yahweh we pray that we we are protected because we do the things that that, that the lord delights in by warning the people and, and, and carrying in his customs and traditions, man. You see? So, you know, we need the Passover because we need the protection, man. You need you need to have a relationship with Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. And that's, you know, as I just said earlier in the video, that's that's another thing that the Passover represents. You renewing your vows to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. And don't the scriptures speak on uh, vowing? Cause sometimes I say better better if you would not vow. But this we have we have no other option but to vow to Yahweh Bashim Shah, man. We have no other option but to dedicate our lives to Yahweh Bashim Shah. Because other than that, what life is there? If you don't got the spirit, what 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 type of life are you living, man? You know, you just out here bugged out, waiting, waiting, waiting to be a uh, missile food, waiting to be a uh, martial law, uh <coughs> Martial law a prisoner. You know, a lot of you women waiting waiting to be uh waiting to be great. Waiting to be taken, waiting, waiting to be snatched in human traffic. It's it's real out here, man. It's real out here. But uh, you know, with that, I just wanted to speak on that a bit. You know, Lord willing is edifying all praises, honor, and glory. It goes Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakwadash. Double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders of Great Millstone. How about Shemiah Shah? Break it down to the full edge. Shalom, shalom.